Welcome back, everyone. This is Superstar Brother playing The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Well, let's see. What have we done? Hello, Postman. Ah. Oh. Hmm. Um, it seems like Kremia was in the uh, previous two chapters. Maybe. Well, well, sure not. We, uh, let's see. We uh, helped Toto and Gorman on a night, and so we went back in time to see if we could help Anju out. And let me think. Anju, yes, we probably don't want to talk to her before then. Otherwise, we won't be able to, uh, get a key. That's what we're after. So then, what are we going to do in the meantime? Well, we haven't actually slowed time down yet. Hmm, I hear. I hear a mailbox. I. Let me think. Oh, what we could probably do. Excuse me, sir. Stop right there! Have you some errand in the canyon? Yes. It is dangerous outside the town wall, so I cannot allow a child like you to. The sword? My apologies, sir. It was wrong of me to treat you like a child. Canyon at Stone Tower lies this way. Be careful. Will do. Alright, in order to get to the canyon, we're. We're gonna call Ebony. Hello, Epina. Alright. Hmm, you know I forgot something though. I really forgot oh, nuts. Yeah. Butter biscuits. Yeah, while well, we're on our horse, we're invincible, so even though these guys go kaboom, it won't hurt us one bit. Or a horse. Go figure. Epona is a immortal. Skull Kid may have tried to kill her, but she is immortal. She is like a god. She cannot be killed by a mere Skull Kid. <laughs> yeah, I only have ten rupees, and they don't have anything else, and it's a... Oh, bother. The reason I'm having such a fuss is because, in order to help the guy that I was trying to get to, we will need money, we will need potion, we will need... Yes. We need that. So I guess we'll see if uh, if it can be bought here. I don't think it can. There's a few things that can be bought here, but potions probably not one of them. Oh, hey, how about that? We can buy it. Welcome. What are you looking for? I'm not looking for this. This is thirty rupees and nutty butter. I'll be back. I will be back with rupees. In the meantime, though, let's see. This is about twelve. Let's see where we are in our uh, notebook. It's about that time, almost. Yeah, I need to. Oops, not deposit. I need to take out some rupees. No, never mind. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Yes, I did. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Ugh. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Zero rupees? Oh, that's a cruel joke. Yeah, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I really didn't mean to. I'm going to withdraw some rupees. I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah, that was a very mean joke. I'll make it up to you. I promise. Alright, um, let's see. Nine. I'll need nine rupees to cover that. And one rupee. Okay, that should be an even 30. Alright, good deal. Thank you. Thank you for being such a good sport. Hello, you. Welcome. What are you looking for? I am looking for this. This is something I want. Hey, thanks again. See ya. Alright, it's getting to be about that time, so we'll go ahead and go meet Anju. We may want to hurry. Faster, Link! Faster! 
Who knows? Who knows what happens? All right, come here. Come on, go. Wait, where is she? But this is good news. The fact that she's gone means that it has not happened yet, so this is good news. We'll just wait for her. Ever so patiently. Because we are good customers, we are good patrons. <laughs> I had plenty of time, what was I doing? I had not enough time to go do what I wanted to do. Okay, hello. Welcome to the stock pot inn. Uh, did you have a reservation? Yeah. Oh, you do have a reservation. That's good. Mr. Link, is it? One moment, please. Mr. Link, I have you down for an afternoon arrival. Your room is our knife chamber on the second floor. Here's your key. Alright, we got a room key. <laughs> You're not sure why, but you apparently had a reservation. Of course, I did say yes, so... This is fortunate. It was added to your notebook. Please relax. Alright. I mean, there is a moon that's going to come crashing down on everybody in three days' time. And, uh... And I've got four giants to waken and all that. But this is our, this is our room in the knife chamber. And in here, we get this nice little return. A silver rupee! It's worth 100 rupees. You're pretty happy. Yes, I am. Alright, this here. What a ramshackle in! Is this room first class? You can hear whoever's next door for crying out loud! <laughs> I'm sure they could hear you. Well, whatever. We're staying for free, so we can't expect much. <laughs> yeah, no. On top of that, thank you, Tattle. On top of that, we're, st we're staying for free. We steal a guy's room at and it's for free. Oh. oh well, we got time travel on our side. We can always reverse things. Oh, postman. All right, the guy we stole the room from, we have actually seen him before. The guy we stole the room from hasn't come in yet, apparently. And we'll be seeing him. Hello, sir. I hope the pony's still out there. There you are. All right, let's go. We got somebody to make happy. Boom. Immortal horse. Come, my immortal horse. Hey! Which I guess is actually kind of ironic, since Epona is actually the name of a goddess of horses. What the heck? What was that? What was that? Okay, this is the reason why we need her, so we can jump over there. Alright, I'm going to stay on top of here, because it's safer up here with Epona. Alright, having done that, now let's pull out our uh, Lens of Truth. Because if we come over this way, pull out our land of truth, we see this guy! Huh? Don't tell me. That's... I'm shocked. You're the first person who's ever spoken to me. I've been here for many years, waving my arms around and asking for help, but everybody, everyone ignores me and passes me by. You've been there for years? Good grief. That must have been terrible. It's because I'm about as impressive as a stone, right? I'm used to it, though. Um, I have a request. Can you give me some medicine that would make an, even an unnoticeable stone like me feel better? Well, yep, that's actually what about this for. <coughs> there you go, buddy. Oh, that... Is that it? That's it. I feel better, I think. Thanks. Oh, here. In gratitude. We got the stone mask for that! Where it would seem to become as plain as stone. Now, let me practice standing out. Shiro, the stone soldier, was added to your notebook. You helped the inconspicuous soldier. This was added to your notebook. Alright! Now then. 
probably want to get back. Maybe. Whoa, Nelly! Because there is a postman that needs... Oh, yes. We uh, need to talk to Andrew. That's right! That's right, that's right. Uh, is there anything else we need to do before, before night falls? Ah, yes, we do need to meet. No, 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 this is the first night. Never mind. Ah, but yes, there is something that needs to be done at this... <clears throat> yes. It's all coming back to me. Oof, a bike. Oh, yep, here's the poor fella that was kicked out of house and home. It's a hard world to live in, girl. Yeah. Poor guy. Let's see. Did the uh, postman... Have you been to the clock tower plaza yet? They are now putting together what has become the carnival's custom. It should be wonderful this year, too. I hope you enjoy our tradition. Well, I don't imagine that tradition involves being obliterated by a giant moon with evil... Alright, I'm gonna... Yes, we do. Okay. Hold on, we need to put on a mask. That's... That was uh, my mistake. You're also looking for cafe? Yep. I have a request. Cafe, I have a clue that will help you find it. Tonight at 11.30, please come to our kitchen. We'll talk then. All right, like a plan. Sounds like a plan. All right, with the night approaching very quickly, let's see now. So we've done that. We just need to wait for midnight. We're close to it. So I guess, let's see. Granny might be a good way of actually speeding time up. Maybe. Actually, I don't think she will speed time up at night. I think she prefers to tell you off for being up at that late. Hey, Granny. How's it going? Oh, Tortoise. Did you finish helping Father? Then let Mother read you a story. Now, which story would you like to hear? Oh, the Carnival of Time. That's going for two hours, and we probably won't kill that much time. The Carnival of Time, is it? The Carnival is almost here, so it's good for you to learn its meaning. It's a little long, but I'll read it with some enthusiasm. Ahem. <laughs> the Carnival of Time. Each year, the season of harmony begins when the sun and moon are in alignment. Paying homage to the way that both nature and time are tirelessly in the process of progressing, the Carnival of Time is when the peoples of the four worlds celebrate that harmony and request fruitfulness for the year. <laughs> oh, are you awake? <laughs> what? I guess that story was a little boring for Tortoise, wasn't it? Don't give up. Try again sometime. Okay. Oh, yeah, Granny's Diary. It was, it was her granddaughter who cooked again today, but it got to the lip the life. Ugh. Seeing as how long you've been living, I don't... S Wait a minute. Hold on. Something's not right here. Yeah, it should be... Actually, if we hadn't... If we hadn't, uh, room, reserved that room, she would be kicking us out at around 8. But, let's see. I guess I could see if uh, Granny could read to us again, skip a few hours. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see if she can help us to skip a few hours. 8, 10, to 12, that sort of thing. Hey, Granny, can you uh, put us to sleep again? Oh, Tortoise, you're late. Tomorrow is another early day, so good night. I'll read you a story tomorrow. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Oh, well, we can wait. We've got stuff that we can do. So then, I guess we'll just come up here. The reason for that? Oh, yes. I'm sorry. The wind. <clears throat> the 
wind has got him damp. Go, tomorrow is rain. Go, go, go. Yeah. Poor guy has to sleep out in the rain, in the cold, at night. But, with that, this is Super Stud Brother. To be continued. I thank you kindly for watching this video. There's further adventure to be had by clicking next chapter. There's exposition to be had by clicking previous chapter. There are timely notifications to be had by clicking subscribe. And finally, there is much gratitude to be had by clicking like. Thank you.